you showed me that picture. You said that y'all, that same year you seen Adam, y'all almost got into it with somebody at Summer Smash. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He's talking about that off camera. Oh, yeah. Because yeah. that, that's what I always wonder about that festival is like, does that happen? Because it's like, it's oh, yeah. right in the middle of Chicago. But I'm going to be honest, the year I went, I saw very, very few people that looked like they were from a neighborhood in Chicago. <laughs> I'm going to be real. I mean, it's like 80% white Man, kids. I Let's ben start Man there. Kevin, he was icy. He said, man, Kevin almost got took. Yeah? Hell yeah. Oh, so that's, who? Who, that's who almost got it. Ben Man Kevin almost got Somebody oh. got took that day. But Ben Man Kevin almost got took. Oh, shit. It was a couple of uh, I seen uh, Ace Boogie with the hoodie. He ain't almost get took, though, because uh, I have respect for it because he was doing songs with Dirk and shit like that. Mm. But some other love. Miscellaneous. They got took for Word. sure. Hmm. But shout out to uh, Kiddo Curry. Y'all need to get him up here. He was saying with Wack 100, he performed that day. He was with Blueface and them. Oh, really? You don't know who Kiddo Curry is? I heard the name, but I never listened to him. Yeah. Hell yeah. He go crazy. Yeah. Well, he, he, may, he ain't been doing no music. Drop some, bitch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm glad y'all ain't robbed my boy Ben Man, though, man. 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 <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Okay, or me. Uh, like, you don't be wearing I just said I was doing the one. I was the one doing the rock. Whoever it was, right? Whoever I'm just it was. Glad, but, uh, you know what I'm saying. I don't know. But you yeah. think that shit was Moisey though. Ooh, Ooh. I heard you, 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 think you think it was Moisey night though? Honestly, y'all would have been mad. I'm, I'm not a jewelry man. expert, so Ben Man Kevo. Oh, you trying to? All right. You got real abs. You got real <laughs> jewelry. Check. You got real followers, as far as I know. Check. He be getting real. Yeah. What What are you doing? I'm just saying he. He could have got took. Right. I don't know why it didn't happen. I don't know why. I don't know. God is good. <laughs> All the time. Big folks is good. Big folks was probably watching over him. Oh, yeah, him. big folks with him, too. <laughs> big folks won't win with him. <laughs> but what that would have meant? What do, big what folks do, one of them big GDs out there. What you mean? <sighs> Here you go. He is, though. He one of the older guys. Then he put a okay, lot of people on his shit. Okay, okay, okay. But what do that mean, though, to somebody that need it or want it? Facts. Busted, I don't know. He told me a story about getting kidnapped by some oh, yeah, Mexicans, yeah, yeah. so he drove that. into a building and they died and damn, crazy shit. That's that's should, I, should, I, should come, I should come up with a story like that. Should, damn, you I should don't believe about it. That. I should have thought about that before I came, like a raw ass story where I got kidnapped by some Mexicans and got robbed. So you shit. think he's lying? A plug and shit. No, it's a good story. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's going to get the people <laughs> watching like, oh, he got kidnapped. And you know, somebody else going to tell the story. Like, yeah, you know, Ben, I mean, what's his name? Big folks. Big folks got kidnapped. Duh, duh, duh. That's a good storyline. Because the internet, bro, you could fool them. You could fool the internet, bro. We got 1090 Jakes out now, so there's only so much fooling you could do. What that mean? He Niggas is getting paperwork pulled and shit. There's only so much fooling you could do until it's going to catch up. By the end, you might be rich. Well, yeah. It's all about getting out this shit. So you don't think, you don't think, you think Big Folks is just lying or he just told a story? I don't know him, but this just yeah. sound crazy. Definitely sounded crazy, but I've had that many times on this podcast where somebody tell me a crazy ass story, and then at some point in the future, somebody will be like, "You really believe that?" And I'll be like, "God damn it!" <laughs> now that I think about it, the fact that I was so impressed by the story does yeah. make me also feel like, "Fuck, maybe that didn't." Because Rico Reckless had a story about back in the day. I didn't know shit. He told me that he went to the gas station, sees a fan, they start asking him for a photo or whatever, but then, they, I forget, they said something disrespectful, so he goes out and he like gets in his car and dips or whatever, and then they fucking shoot. He was in an Uber, on video and they song? shoot, and they fucking hit him in the shoulder into the Uber from like Damn. a block away or some shit. And I'm thinking, that's the craziest story ever. Then I forget who, somebody was like, you really believe that? I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> it does it does sound a little hard. I, 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 I believe him and he's like double down on it over yeah. and over. So Rico, I don't know. Rico, I, 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 fuck with, I, fuck with, I believe. I fuck with uh, Rico. Reckless. Reckless. Yeah. Reckless up? Up. We he, he was um we was supposed to do a song we fought too. Mm. Rico be out here. He probably somewhere out in L. A. Right now. He be probably moving. he be yeah. moving around and shit. Shout out Reckless. Um. Right. So, do you feel like is drill music dead or is or is it just waiting for the next? Hell no, nah, drill music ain't dead, bro. It's it's going. Mm. It's still going, especially Sosa. Then Sosa just dropped. Facts. Yeah. Sosa back. Dropped last night. I think I think him and Dirk finna. That's what they saying. Dirk and him do the collab album. 
Or a song that's gonna go crazy, man. That's gonna be stupid. And they do bro. the tour, even just a song. I think they finna go. I, I, a song's I think, not. I think enough. Sosa finna go on tour. But a song would be a such start. a big deal it that it would be, be fucking right nuts. Song, though, gotta, that's probably why they ain't do it yet because they gotta be the right song for it. Gotta go crazy. Yeah, it gotta go crazy. It gotta yeah. go crazy because it can't be mediocre. They gonna be like, uh, and then did you listen to the social album? What was your thoughts on it? You, I, I, ain't, I was supposed to came out listen, last night. I I'm gonna listen to it on the way back um, to one one. I listen to it. You got some slaps on there. Yeah. I mean, it's a start. It's a start. It's a start. It's a start. A lot of people are saying it's amazing. I don't know the. I don't, I ain't hear it yet. They say Sosa just be chilling, man. Sosa just rich. No, you want to know the fucking crazy thing about Sosa is that he did an Apple Music interview. I seen like a, a one minute clip, yeah. and I've never seen him looking this sober and this clear headed. You know, like the yeah. whole time you ever seen him in an interview, he's got the dreads in his face yeah, and he's yeah, yeah. smoking and he like ain't really trying to answer the questions or whatever. He's sitting there talking like a normal person. And I'm just like, what the fuck is this? Like, where like is it this? Love it. It's fucking amazing. Yeah. He sounds super smart. And like, it's just so weird to see him like that now. I've never seen that side of him. Like kind of in real life, I've seen that side of him, yeah. of him just having normal conversations, but definitely not on camera. 